Hey guys, so today I want to do a quick little video here comparing Apple's voice assistant Siri versus Google Now on my Galaxy S4. So I did a video like this a few hours ago and uh, I compared uh, Siri versus S voice and S voice just got pretty much palmed uh, compared to Siri and um, this that video got like 140 plus likes and only 10 dislikes so I mean it got pretty palmed. It got, it got Pond and yeah, smacked hard. Uh, but what about Google Now, which is uh, Google's own voice assistant that is actually pretty decent? Uh, let's compare them. Let's compare them. Let's compare them. What's the weather like? It's okay, 55 degrees and mostly cloudy and I'm coping. Okay, so I think there that we do have a winner. I think actually Siri was a little bit faster, but the first thing we see here is that definitely Google Now palms S Voice. It's much, much, much quicker in responding. And, and the, yeah, so let's try some other things. Set timer for 15 minutes. Okay, 15 Setting minutes alarm. and counting. There we go. You can see here that we have an option to disable it or, or to disable it there for a few seconds. Here, I can tap on it and go in, instantly in here and console it. Uh, but both works really, really good here. Uh, let's try another little thing. Let's uh, try, let's see here. Set alarm at 11 p.m. Setting alarm set for 11 p.m. And now also in this little thing you can actually disable it instantly over here, which is kind of nice. Uh, let's try if we would <laughs> Google for something. And I'm mean, gonna use Google here because I mean, not like almost every, every single guy on earth use it. So Google cats. Searching Google for cats. So of course if you use Google a lot to search it's gonna be pretty much, I mean, Google Now will be faster. You can probably also say, let's see here. Yeah, if you wanna search again uh, with your voice, you have to, of course, push in here, and here you just have the button up here. Oops. Oh my God. No! Why <laughs> you said oops? It thinks I said something else. Okay, that was random. People are gonna comment about that, though. <laughs> that was random. Search for dogs and cats at the same time. I'm not sure I understand. Search for dogs. Okay, I found this on the web. So just when you say search, uh, it will bring up the search results instantly in this kind of assistant over here. I'm not sure though if it's Bing search results or if it's something else. Yeah, it's only Bing, and that's kind of sucks. I mean, who uses Bing? I mean, come on, Apple. Come on, Apple. Come on, when I say search, I don't want to use Bing. It's retarded. Uh, <laughs> well, anyways, okay, that's random. Okay, Apple, but maybe doesn't like Google. <laughs> Google, bad. Searching Google for dogs. No. Okay, that was wrong. Okay, that was a little bit random. It said search for Google, but it just went to Google. Okay, awkward. Uh, let's try some other things. Let's uh, try... Open camera. So this one will, you can tap on it and disable it also. See, and then it will open up there, but definitely open up quicker here and automatically on the iPhone, which is a little bit interesting. Uh, okay, let's try some math math question here. Uh, let's try... What is 2 plus 18 minus 8? Checking. The answer is 12. What is 2 plus 18 minus 8? Okay, so this one seems to be having problems when I say 2. What is 2 plus 2? Two? 
What? What? Come on, go now. What are you doing? In it. <laughs> okay, that was wrong. What is 2 plus 18 minus 8? For some reason, this one doesn't understand sometimes when I say two, uh, but this one that was at the other t other uh, other page here did understand immediately. Um, how many people live in Sweden? The population of Sweden, population of Sweden was 9.517 million, million in 2012. So you can see here that the display is search a little bit uh, different. Uh, here we can see almost like a Wikipedia, uh, the population here. And then we do have a quick access to show map or see for article. Here we instantly also could see the map, a little bit of a brief view. And you also get the Google results here immediately used down at the bottom. And here you also get a cool kind of like graph uh, where you can see how it's going with the population and everything. That looks pretty awesome. <clears throat> Let's try another thing. Note to self, I hate cats, or no, I'm just kidding, I like cats actually, I love them and I want to have two when I grow older. Saving note. Here's your note. I hate cats. Wow, that's pretty cool here that you can see instantly. Uh, you did see here, uh, note. Uh, okay, it did also have note to self, it did add that. Uh, While well, this one didn't add that, you just added, made a quick note. Uh, but what was cool about this one was that when you talked in Google Now, you did see like a live update about what was going on, which I do actually enjoy. Uh, here also it didn't close the note immediately, which was pretty nice, I think. Uh, I hate cats, or no, I'm just kidding. I like cats, actually, 11, and I want to have to, what? Okay, that's wrong. Uh, I hate cats like to sleep alone. <laughs> of course, it's just because of my accent. Um, let's try another thing. Open calendar. <laughs> so this one won't bring up Samsung's own calendar. Uh, it will bring up uh, Google's own calendar that you can download. Pretty funny, I think. Shut down phone. Okay, I found this on the web. Okay, so you, you can't turn off a phone um, by saying shut down. That would be pretty cool though. Um, do I have any meetings tomorrow? You don't have any meetings on your calendar for tomorrow. Okay, so this one did find that out. This one, uh, Google now, I had no idea. What will happen in 2014? Checking. Okay, I found this on the web. So both bring did bring up some search results here, which is pretty interesting. Uh, of course, I can continue doing this forever, but uh, I would actually say that, I mean, both are very, very good things. Uh, if you mainly just going to use Google a lot, Google Now is definitely going to be good if you, you like to search with your voice. This one has to open up Google and the app, while this is a little bit more integrated already. Uh, but then also, of course, we do have the thing with Siri that's a little bit more like an assistant. You can talk, chit chat, and it's very, very intelligent in many ways. I would actually say that it's a little bit smarter in, in some areas, uh, but both are very, very well developed. You can see Google Now uh, and uh, Siri is good voice assistant, um, at least better than S-Voice. Yeah, have a good day.